Hi, my name is Kara Birch and I am from the University of California, San Francisco. I recently started there as assistant clinical professor in community health systems in the Department of Nursing. So I teach in the psych mental health nurse practitioner uh, track, teaching um, some family practice and some psych psychiatry courses. And I'm excited to be starting doing that and growing as an educator. But I also hold a large clinical portion at UCSF. So most of my time uh, is in the clinical setting on a care support team, which is an interdisciplinary team that takes patients that are referred from primary care and also from ACOs that have high utilization and to chronic conditions. So heart failure and diabetes, depression, uh, and asthma, any two chronic conditions um, that aren't engaging in care or aren't improving um, as, as much as they really could be. Maybe they're not taking their medications, they're going to the ER for anxiety surrounding their, um, you know, maybe respiratory symptoms really, and their anxiety is, you know, difficult to manage on top of that. So two chronic things that are going on, and we have social work and pharmacy, a geriatrician, a psychiatry is represented, and then some um, primary care providers on our team. And we all kind of work around uh, together to support patients along with a navigator that helps to reach out to the patient weekly and try to engage them in our services. So it's a really interesting team. We're uh, kind of evolving and growing, and my role on the team is as a team member to uh, provide a lot of psychiatric consultation because I'm both FNP and psych NP and kind of look at medical causes for psychiatric issues and also addressing some of their psychiatric issues. So it's really interesting to see our university kind of changing and trying to come up with new ways to to help patients that are, have high utilization and that just aren't really doing very well in the primary care setting. So in my background, uh, I started actually started out in primary care and uh, loved it, and but also saw a really vast need for assessment and treatment of mental health concerns. Um, everything from people that were grieving and needed support groups to people that were paranoid and having some real psychosis in the primary care setting. And, that, you know, it was just really difficult to manage and it's very difficult to get into to see psychiatry with long wait times. So one of my big passions is um, figuring out how do we address this. And so after I started out in my training in primary care as a nurse practitioner, I realized this was an issue and an interest of mine. So I went back in, did dual uh, certification and got my doctorate of nursing practice, uh, which is a, a clinical doctorate uh, versus the PhD in nursing. Um, to specialize in both family nurse practitioner and psychiatric nurse practitioner. So yeah, that's a little bit about me. I um, am really excited to see kind of how all of our concepts evolve and how we begin to, to think about how we might be able to make a big impact uh, in these practice-based research networks over time and to engage in them more, really just to learn alongside you all and grow uh, as, a, as a new uh, faculty member and kind of and have some other expertise around me so I'm really thankful for that so I look forward to getting to know you all and uh, and wish you all well and we'll talk to you all next week